Hello everybody, this is Caleb Gamers from Friendship Productions. I hope that you are having a great afternoon. Um, I am playing a game called Valley. Now this game just came out this summer of 2016. It is looks gorgeous from the commercial, it looks gorgeous from the trailer, um, and I can't wait to get started in it. So let's go ahead. Uh, the name of the game is called Valley. I don't know anything about it. I really don't. Like, um, I watched the trailer, but that's about it. I know it looks really cool, though, and I can't wait. So, let's dive in and find out what's going to happen. Oh, okay. <laughs> it went all that just to get me to the start menu. Okay. I am mail. All right. The life seed is said to contain an incredible, earth-shattering power. While mostly written off as myth, mostly, some archaeologists are still determined to track down this elusive item, luring some to the incredibly remote locations. And I take it that I'm probably going to be headed into some incredibly remote locations. <laughs> but, but no, like, serious. So there's a live seed. It's got incredible earth-shattering power. What kind of earth-shattering power are we talking about here? Is it, like, life and death? Is it, I, I guess? I don't know. It's just earth-shattering. So does that mean it's, like, powerful enough to destroy a planet? <laughs> I don't really know. I hope that we'll find out soon. Man. And it's like, it says mostly written off as myth. What does mostly mean? Does that, I mean, is there like documents for it and documents against it? What is it? I want to know. I want answers. I want to know everything. Ugh. With this game being so new out, I don't think there's very many Let's Play videos of it yet. So if you really want to know more and you want to see more, don't forget to like and subscribe after this video or even during this video. And uh, stay tuned because I will be continuing on this. Um, I'm probably going to hit and finish up with my Five Nights at Freddy's Let's Play over the weekend. Well, probably after the weekend because I got a test on Monday in Calculus. But I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to finish that up probably early next week. And then I'm going to work on this to get this done probably take a break from five nights at freddy's for just a little bit and then hit it up with five nights at freddy's 2 a little bit later on but um uh i just wanted to wish you luck before you headed out i still can't believe you're doing this i mean i'm hunting down the what was it the life seed you gotta admit that sounds crazy i mean even if this mythological thing that can shatter worlds or whatever actually exists what are the chances of you tracking down this ancient relic in the middle of the rocky mountains listen I know you want to prove the thing exists. I get that. It's an adventure. Hell, it's your career, but can't you do something normal like the rest of us and just backpack Europe or something? Spend a month in Thailand? But hey, if by some miracle you find this thing and become the most famous archaeologist of all time, yours are on me. I'll even trade in your tinfoil hat for a whip and fedora. I just really hope all those canoeing lessons pay off. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. So that's that's very interesting though. I mean with friends like those, who needs enemies? <laughs> but seriously. So if you noticed on the walls, like I was looking at the walls in the background, so like um, it looks like this guy has been um, searching for this for a long time and that he's been... Oh, okay. Useless discount canoeing lessons. I don't know. I'm trying to do a voice for him. <laughs> okay. Let's see what we got here. So we got... Some, yeah, that's a say It's some useless canoeing. I agree totally with you. But, you know, then poses the question of... Would you... I don't even know... What is this place anyway? Where am I? Okay, so 
We went canoeing to find the life seed of earth shattering power. Leave it space. Okay. Some sort of ruins in a cave. Very nice, very nice. I have no idea what's going on, but I will say the scenery looks not flat in ruins? Cave drawings? Where the am I? What is that? What is that? Is that some creepy crawly going to come out and get me? Is that another Freddy Fazbear wanting to stuff me in a Freddy suit? Oh my. The waterfall. How pretty. Okay, okay, nothing seems to be in here. Nothing seems to be in here at all. How did you shift to the run? Oh, that's nice. Ooh, what is that? Okay. Some sort of picture of a man. Manly picture of manliness. More water. Okay, let's get out of the cave. Alright, now where on earth are we? Where are we? Ooh. I do like the music. I like it a lot. Let me go down this way. I don't think there's anything for me to really interact with right at the moment. I think I'm just supposed to, like, th this seems like all tutorial stuff. I'm, I am looking around, though, and, and, like, checking to see if I think something might be of interest. Um, but at the moment, I don't think so. I think I'm just supposed to go down here, actually. So that's what I'm going to do. But I do like the music a lot. Oh, the title! And look at that! Look at the birds! Oh! And wow, with the view! That's incredible! That's awesome! <laughs> like, I'm so stoked! Man, the music's awesome! <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm just so... I just feel so adventurous right now. I just want to run through the fields. I want to do something, I want to whack something. We're going to adventure. Okay, let me go down here. Look at those lights! And the tree! This is just like that movie that was so popular back in when that I cannot remember for the life of me the name of. But it's just like that movie. Okay. If I click on it, it brightens up. How awesome is that? Oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> it makes me so happy. Okay, so, okay. Let's go down here and find out what's going on. Where am I? Like, what is this remote place? I want to go canoeing here. <laughs> like, this is awesome. This is obviously on Earth. Oh, wow. 
What are those? Oh, they look like owls. Except they're not. I'm gonna call them the Hootums. Hello, Hootums. Can I click on you, Hootums? Haha, -ha, I think I... Uh, actually, I think... Yes, when I click on them, they brighten up. I think. Haha. -ha. Such fun, such fun. <laughs> okay, here we go. And... Wow. I have no idea why there's the Hootums here, but I like the Hootums. They're fun. Okay. What is this place? How hard did I hit my head? I don't know, mister. That's up to you and yourself. But I don't think... You I don't think this is a dream, though. Oh, it smiled at me. Did you see that? <laughs> that was so nice. Um, I don't think this is a dream. I think this is actually stuff that's happening. Let's go up here. I don't really think there's anything to interact with down there. All right. Ooh, an old army truck? Must have crashed here ages ago. Okay. Looks like a mechanical suit. Okay, then. Cool leaf suit, huh? It's crisp. Ooh! Ooh! I can jump. Let's see what's on these old audio reels. Actually exists? The Northeast dig site is providing a number of clues towards the stone cutting techniques of the ancient inhabitants. The pathfinders assigned to exploring the site have uncovered a wide array of tools that may have been used. With any luck, we can attempt to reproduce the methodology. Ooh. Okay. Let's go this way. Like, this is so interesting, sir. The story is so cool. So basically, if you're not getting it, so you, these people 
they um, were here looking for this life seed and they built these suits for people to come out and in in um, just kind of explore the area and these suits make it easier for them to explore okay running down slopes to gain momentum uh, to gain momentum to jump higher and further okay Let's go over here then. Aha, uh -huh. let's jump this fence. Oh, I love the music. Oh, that's awesome. Whoa, ran into a brick. All right, let's go down here. So I love the jumping mechanism. The jumping mechanism is awesome. This reminds me a lot of the portal suit that you you got to wear. Man, they did so much detail on this terrain too. I mean, look at this. Oh, I must have. Water's no good for the suits. Okay, that makes sense. Yes, yes. Water, water makes suit bad. Bad suit. There we go. All right, now we're doing it. Let's go down this way. Boy, all these dead trees around here. What happened there? Energy stored within the leaf suit, known as Emerita, can be given to once living things, okay? What's that? Collect en enough acorns to gain access through ancient doorways. Oh, so those are things that need to be collected. Okay, let's go this way. Alright. such a sense of adventure to it you know like it's, it's really cool um right now this game's even on sale and steam if you want to go check it out touch an orb to absorb its energy okay oh that's how i gain back energy okay that's sweet okay let's go down this way i feel like oh wait wait wait, wait, wait. maybe i need to Definitely can't wait for this. Ooh, 
Oops. Didn't mean to do that. What's that? These medallions are said to be used to access an ancient pyramid. Collect enough pieces to gain entry to its members. Okay. Changes. Don't know anything about an ancient pyramid, but... Acorns, got my medallion, We're doing good. I'm supposed to go this way, I don't really know. Okay, let's see. Okay. Life can also be taken away from you by being with your energy. Okay. I'm just gonna leave it there. That's so much fun though. There's so much so many things you can do with this suit, man. It's just like the best suit. Uh, think of it. Your pets. You can restore your pets every single time with the suit. And it would be always good. Always okay. Like, they would always just come back, and you'd never ha have another dead pet again. <laughs> you get the same pet forever, <laughs> I guess. I don't exactly know how that works. I'm still kind of reeling and wondering over that. Okay. What's this place? Oh! Oh, were there signs? I bet you there were signs up there. Oh, I should have read those. Oh, so this must be the ruins. This must be the dig site. Okay. Oh, what was that? That was some sort of horn beast of some kind. Find the way through the ancient ruins. Okay, so this is where I'm going to pause for today. I hope you have enjoyed this game as much as I have. I will go uh, and continue this game soon. Like I said, I'm going to do my FNAF series, probably finish that up next week, early next week. And then I'll get on this. But this game looks really awesome. And I can't wait for more videos. I, I hope you have enjoyed. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.